Throw your arms so deep in there. Like, look how big that plate go is. Oh, right here, wait, we got, we got. Oh, no, I got it. Oh, I got it. <laughs> Ow. Oh. Oh. oh, oh my God, Dakota, Dakota. It's a freaking eel. Come on, oh. 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 We got one. Ready? Look at that. What's up, DFP Nation? Welcome back to another awesome video, guys. Today, we are doing something I've never done before on the channel. I've never even done it. It's just crazy. I got a call from my friend Dakota behind the camera. He said in his neighborhood, there are these like holes that these fish dig. They're called placos. They like dig these holes into the ground and the water rose recently because of all the rain and a bunch of fish go in there as like shelter, all the little bait fish. And then the water dropped and now these fish are trapped in there. There's holes literally all along this pond. And we're gonna go around with some nets, net around these holes and see what we can find in them. It's gonna be crazy. He said these holes literally go on forever. Like you can stick your arm in it and it just keeps going. So I don't know what we're gonna find in there. Let's head down there. There's one literally like, where is it right there? Yeah, right over here. Let's go check it out. I have a little net in the thing, but I wanna try and catch one with my hands, you know? Oh. This one's in the water still, but a lot of, he said a lot of the other ones are out of the water. Look, this one got filled in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like picture one like out of the water right here, still filled with water. That There's a lot down there like that. This one, the water has and dropped enough for them to get trapped but there might be something in there dude i don't like this dude i'm sticking my hands <laughs> let's see how deep your arm can go <laughs> all right three two one stick your hand in oh it gets cold bro go all the way in bobby yeah, full sick. send bro, I'm still going. full send bobby it's so cold full oh, send the bottom i'm feeling the bottom ew there's nothing down there it's like it's like algae wait what, you got something? Hold on. Hold wait, on. Throw your arms so deep in there. Dude, wait, let me pick up what I'm feeling. It's just like algae down there, dude. Oh, wait, it goes over here too. It like curves down there. It's just rocks, bro. I don't think there's any, anything in this one. Oh, I wish you guys could feel what I'm feeling right now. This is weird. All right, yeah, nothing in that one, but you see how deep that goes? That is crazy. Is there any others? What is this? Oh, that's like a mini one. See, these fish, I don't know how they make these holes because it's literally rock, but these placos, they dig into the bank and that's why a lot of people hate them here because they literally dig these holes. There's another one right down there. Dakota, where'd you say the other ones? Like the the, other, ones the big ones are over there. All right, let's go head down there. But that was like a little teaser. That's like what we're getting into right now. The other ones he said are out of the water now and, and whatever's in there is trapped. So hopefully something was in there. Guys, we're driving down the lake. Um, you, you've walked around the whole thing. Yeah, dude, I live here. <laughs> right over there. How many? There's like two or three. Like, what if there's a snake in there, dude? Or like a snapping turtle or alligator? Right, right over here. Oh, don't... Wait, you see him? No, look. Look, what? look, get out. Look at that. What is that? It's a plinkle out of the water. Dude. Look at this thing. What the? Oh, dude, there's a big fish Oh, it's there. by the holes. Oh, dude, it must have been digging. <laughs> oh, no, it's dead. Dude, look, see, this one got filled in. Oh, yeah. Okay, see. Oh, dude, 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 I see a fish in there. Where? Dude, it was just on top of the water. No way. Dude, check grabbing it. It was on top of the water. Actually? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <gasps> oh, I just hit it. Bro, I just hit it. Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see it. Oh, oh my God. Dude. Dakota, that's... apple snail. Eat him. <laughs> There's an apple snail in there. Hold on. Before we find out what's in the hole, there's another one here. Another big hole. Ew. Dude, wait, wait. That's the biggest place. Dude, how, how do you think it died? I don't know. It's... Ew. Oh, ow! Oh my God. Dude. I'm gonna throw up. I'm gonna throw up. That must have been the same otter that killed uh, all the other fish with the claw knife. Bro, look at, its face is eaten off. Dude, the otters eat their face. Ew! Ew! Real quick, look how big that plate is. I don't know if he was digging a hole. Maybe this was his home, bro. He was right next to it. He was right next to it. There's a fish in there, bro. There's a fish, Dakota. I see his fin. Ew, okay, I'm just gonna like discard this right here. I'm just gonna put this guy here. That's a massive placo, bro. It's the biggest one I've ever seen. Look at his face is gnawed off, bro. An otter did that. All right. Now we have another hole right here. I touched a fish. I put my hand in and I touched a fish. And then I got an apple snail. Let's see what else is in here. Bro, I don't like this. I'm touching fish right now. Oh, Dakota. I almost said Brandon. <laughs> I mean, there are actually so many in here. Ready? Watch. Right here. Ow. Oh, oh. Dude. There's one in here. They're, they're like in the little crevices. 
Oh, I see, I see, I see. I can't grab them. They're so slippery. We gotta trap them. We gotta trap them. Oh, I got one. I got one. I got one. Ah, I got him. Oh. Oh, right here, wait, we got, we got. Oh, I got. Oh, I got. Ow, ow, ow! Holy crap, there's so Hold many. On, I got one. We we doubled up. <laughs> doubled up, baby. <laughs> there's fish in the hole. Fish Look tap. At <laughs> Look at that. We got two tilapia. They were in that hole, bro. Oh, See dude. what happens. They go into the holes for shelter, you know, hide from the bigger fish. And then when the water drops, they just kind of get stuck in there, and then they're screwed. It must have just happened because like they can't live in there very long without food, but. I mean, they're tilapia. They eat anything. Yeah, that's true. Okay, so we just throw them back, I guess? Yeah. Wait, wait. Let's put them in the bucket. I want to see how many fish we can catch. Oh, up. you can feed them to your fish. Oh, yeah. We can do that. We're feeding them to the fish. New plan. Unless it's like a peacock or something. Yeah, if it's something like native or cool, we'll let it go. But if it's like a cichlid or something, I guess we'll just feed it to our fish. Why not? There's something big in this one. Yeah? Should I just try to grab it? Dude, send I it. Think, I think... Oh, no! Timmy got out. We're down to one Timmy now. All right. Both hands, both hands. Oh, dude, I don't like this. Bo both hands, Bobby. I don't like it, man. Both hands. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What? Oh, it's a big fish. Look at this one. He swam out, bro. He was, you, you disturbed a piece. <laughs> I don't think you're ready for how big this fish is. I think it's t a tilapia. <gasps> right here, right here. Right, oh, wait, where'd he go? Oh, oh he just swam out. Okay, uh, see, see you later, I guess. That's a bluegill. Oh, he's in there. Oh. <gasps> Oh, no, 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 no. Uh-uh, I'm not doing that. What is that? I don't... Look, there's bubbles, bro. That means there's a big fish in here or something. Or like a snake. Oh, I can feel it. I can feel it. Grab him. Oh, I see bubbles. You got him? I'm better. I'm, I'm, I'm going to get a net, bro. Dude, there's like bubbles it. in this one, too. Really? Oh, there is. Hold on. I'm still trying to get this. Where do you go? Oh, oh! Oh, it's massive. I don't even think my net's going to hold him, bro. It's big. Dude, it's kicking up a lot of dirt. Oh, oh my God. Oh, he, okay. he just escaped. There he goes. <laughs> Dude, that's crazy. That was a big tilapia. I think that was the big fish, right? Oh. oh no, there's God. another big fish? Dakota. Ready? <laughs> oh, snap. <laughs> Look how giant those snails are. Dude. You know what? Let's just throw them in the bucket. There's so many. I didn't realize there were snails. That there, there were rocks, bro. There's another one. Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> Those are big apple snails, also invasive. There's another one. Dude, is, it, is this like a ma magician's hat? Yeah, it's like you just keep pulling stuff out. <laughs> Yo, pull out a rabbit. Eddie, I'm gonna pull out a rabbit. <laughs> Dude, look at all the bubbles. I don't like it. All right, we'll come back to this one. I don't think there's anything else in there. What we got so far? Well, two, two, two tilapia escaped and a bunch of bluegills, but we got a bunch of apple snails. Look how many. <laughs> That's insane. Okay, I think this might be the final hole, so. Oh my God, Dakota. What? I'm getting get the net. I'm getting the Go net. get the net. Go get the net. Look how giant this net is. The thing is giant, bro. it's a bunch bro. of little fish, though. Nope, nothing. Scoop. Oh. Feel... oh. <laughs> <laughs> that, that was pretty easy. That's a nice one. That's a little spotted tilapia. Wait, you should have got the net from the beginning. This is, see, this is literally, dude. Oh. Oh my God, I thought he just went. Dude, why am dude. I losing all the fish? We're going to have no food for the fish later. I'm sorry, guys. I tried. I am just had slippery hands right now. That was a spotted tilapia. This is a regular one. So far, it's like only invasives. You know, I need fish, fish food though. I need to stop losing them. Oh, 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 oh my God. So many, bro. I just had three in that one. Don't lose them. Look how, okay. Yeah. I'm just going to dump them in the bucket, bro. Or is a bluegill? Look at this. Oh wait, no, that's not a bluegill. That's a, uh, what's it called? A red ear. Shed shell cracker. Oh, I think it's a shell cracker. We're going to throw them in there. Okay. This is crazy, dude. There's so many fish in these holes. I'm feeling another one. Look at bluegill. Dude, you're, dude, are they, what? They're just appearing in the net. <laughs> wait, have I shown how deep this one is? Look at this, ready? Oh, oh snap. And then, oh, it's all sand at the bottom too. Oh my, look at all the bubbles. Dude, there might be something in there. You think so? Ready, scoop, ready, scoop, I'm scooping. Scoop. I'm scooping. Hello. Anybody home? Maybe that's all of them. I wish we had more fish food though. We kind of, I kind of screwed that up. Oh wait, there's, oh, there's, I was just about to say, I feel, I feel snail. I'm not, dude, that thing's giant. That's are, actually are, giant are those snail. edible, Bobby? Yeah, I'm gonna eat those later. <laughs> Let me feel around, ready? Oh my god. <laughs> There's something definitely in there, dude, because look at these bubbles. They're kicking. What happened? What do you feel? Bro, they're okay. So there's like, look, you can see the rocks, how there's little, like, little, like, you know, cracks and crevices. Yeah. I just stuck my finger in one and it was, I feel. Oh! What does it feel like? 
No, dude, I'm not giving up. There's there's another fish in here. I feel it. <gasps> Did you have oh, it? Oh, oh, dude! What? Dakota, what? Okay, get close. This. Get close, bro. This is serious. What okay, did you hold find, on. Bobby? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Did you not see that? No, I didn't. I was looking at you. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Everyone stay calm. No way. It's like a... Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, I got him. I got him. He was in the little crack, bro. I just scared him out, and now he's, like, going nuts. It's definitely not like... I just hit him again. Right here. Oh, no. It's a freaking bluegill, bro. <laughs> I thought it was something cool. No, 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 no. It was not a bluegill. The thing I brought up, I saw its head. It's not a bluegill. There's literally no way. Cause it looked like, oh, I just, right here. Oh no, it's a leaf. <laughs> Wait, you think it was the bluegill? A bluegill? Dude, I'm telling you there was something else. Maybe I got a like net in the, in the sediment. Ew. <laughs> Ew. Bro, what, what is what that? The? What is that? It's a, a shoe. It, oh, it is. <laughs> Dude, so much. Is that oh. what I was feeling? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you think someone fell down and got their leg stuck? Dude. I guarantee you that's what happened. That oh. one big fish. <gasps> Dude, get him, Bobby. Fish. Get him. What's your song? Get him. Come here. Get him. <laughs> there was a fish living under the shoe, maybe. I'm not giving up, bro. It, it was a fish. That was not a bluegill. It's like, look at this. Okay, they cut it. Come over here. Look at all these wedges. See on the inside? See yeah. how they can go? They can go in there. So there must be some fish hiding in there. That's what I'm saying, dude. Oh! Hold up. Hold up. <gasps> oh, Jesus! It hit my hand. It hit my hand. Hit him back, Bobby. All right, you guys. Plan B. We've been, like, I've been trying to find whatever that fish was for a good 20 minutes. And we can't get it. So I had the idea to just drain the hole using this little thing. And look, it's actually working. I mean... There's not a whole lot of water in here, so if I just drain the whole thing, we'll find whatever is in there, you know? You're such a smart man, Bobby. <laughs> you see all the little cracks and crevices they can live in? Bobby, you are a genius. <laughs> whatever is in here, bro, I guarantee it's like hiding in the cracks, and that's why I'm not seeing it anymore. You guys probably think I'm going crazy. I'm not going crazy. I saw something cool. I can guarantee it. Dude, that's a deep hole. I know. <laughs> With lots of cracks. <laughs> Mucho cracks. Dude, it just keeps going, Bobby. <laughs> I'm almost. Oh my god, Dakota! Dakota! Holy crap! Oh, dude, Over what here. the heck? Oh! Oh my, oh god. my gosh, Bobby! Get it, get it, Bobby! <laughs> Ew! It's a freaking eel! Oh my god! Oh my god, no! It's from the crack! Oh, it's going no! down, it's going down, it's going down! Ah! Did you get it? Did you get it? I got oh, it! Oh, he got it! Holy crap! You got it, Bobby! I wasn't going crazy! I told you guys! I'm sorry, I just know a lot of you guys didn't believe something else was in there. Look at this thing! What the heck is that? Dude! That's a fire eel! No, it's not. That's not a fire eel. Dude, Hold that on. is a... Uh... That's some sort of eel, but it looks like a fire eel. <gasps> Look how sick that is. Wait, you guys. No way we just caught a freaking fire eel in here. Ready? <laughs> oh, my God. <gasps> Wait, that's a different one, bro. I've caught fire eels, a lot of fire eels before, but that's not a fire eel. Because it's got like the... Uh... It's got like a different pattern on it. There's... De you think there's more, bro? Yeah. Hold on. Drain it. I'm just gonna dump the eel. I'm so happy I drained it because I was about to give up, dude. I was like, okay, you know what? Maybe I was seeing things. But what I saw, I think I got it on camera, was when I hit it with my hand and I brought it up. I saw it's like little slender, dark, slimy body. And I was like, that is not a bluegill. <laughs> I'm gonna drain the whole thing, you guys. And we're gonna find out what's in it. That is so sick. You know what? Thinking about it now, this is like a perfect little home for a little fire eel or whatever it is. Cause it's got all the it could cracks. ambush it could ambush all the minnows yeah dude it's got all the little cracks and crevices to hide in it's got sand and this crap on the bottom it can dig in okay first off how does a placo make this hole i don't know someone comment please because i'm pretty sure placos make this hole right there's like a bunch of snails on the cracks oh wow. stick your hand in i thought this was one it was just a snail it's like his tail is that a crawfish or is it crawfish for real he just went into the hole. Wait, there was a crawfish? Yes, it was like a little brown one. It just, I, I grabbed its butt and it just ran in. Dude, I didn't know there was even crawfish in this lake. This is so crazy. There's so many snails. Like, look, snail, snail, snail. Snail, snail. That looks like it's it. Well, dude, holy crap, we caught an eel. What? I, 
I almost stepped in the hole. <laughs> I don't even know what to say, you guys. I've caught so many fire eels recently, like even big ones. A lot of you have been asking for an update. The thing is, they just hide. Soon, I'm gonna do a video where we try to get them out and make sure they're still in there and still alive. But yeah, this looks like a fire eel, like the same thing, but I don't think it is because fire eels have red on them and this one didn't and it had like a different pattern. So if you guys got a good look at that, comment what it is if you know. Dude, I could put it with the axolotl. Oh, dude, that they'll be, be best friends. Yeah. There he is. Come here. <laughs> He's going to bite you. I got him. I got him. I got him. He's going to bite you. Ah! Oh, it's spiny. It's spiny? Yeah, it just spined me, bro. Look Dude, at that. Maybe he bit you. Maybe he's venomous, Bobby. <laughs> Guys, please go down there and leave a like for me sticking my whole freaking face in that hole to try and find what's in it. I was not expecting this, but we might have to come back once these holes fill up again and then they go back down and whatever's in here gets stuck. I might have to come back and do a little part two for you guys, but yeah. We're gonna head to my house now and probably put this guy in the tank and feed all those to the fish. I don't know what I'm doing with these apple snails. I might just throw them back. <laughs> I've never cut this many apple snails in my life. There you go. We're gonna see you guys back in my house. Rise and shine. Hi. Dude. I have another <laughs> fish for your tank. Dude, what you got? Let me show you. Oh. Okay, I gotta, I gotta acclimate them first, but I have an eel. Now, I don't know what kind of eel it is. You can kind of see them here. It's kind of small. Yeah. It looks like a fire eel almost. And I've caught a few of those before, but it doesn't have any of like the red that I usually see on the fire eel. So I'm not 100% sure what it is. But let me acclimate them to the tank. It's a little colder here. So we're gonna acclimate them and then we're gonna put them in with the axolotl, which we're going to name Axolotl Rose. I don't get it. He doesn't get it. He's not, ugh, you know what? You guys get it. That's all that matters. I get it. You guys get it. Brandon doesn't need to get it. Uh, That's Axolotl Rose right there. So so and this is Ely Dan. Okay, Brandon. He's acclimated in the bowl to the fish tank water. Oh, yeah. Come here. Come here. Look. You can really see him good now. It's an eel fish. Okay, guys. Uh, you, you can get a good look at him now. You got to comment what that is. It's definitely not a fire eel, but it's probably like in the same family. Because like it looks just like a fire eel. Wait. Yeah, it looks just like the fire eel without like the red. And it's like a different pattern. I don't know. Inner serve. Here oh, you, you go, Brandon. Thank you. Yeah, here we go. Ready? Get a shot of this. Ready? Here you go, Mr. Eel. Oh. <laughs> oh! Oh my god, him and the axe. Oh! Oh! Did they did he just attack him? Wait, I didn't see it. Did he attack him? Oh! <laughs> he doesn't like him. Okay. Oh, he's going to the other side of the tank. You know what's funny? This eel's one probably gonna legs, dig. <laughs> He's probably gonna dig in the sand, because I think that's what these eels do. So, they can have their own little separate areas in the fish tank, I think. They should be okay. They're just gonna sit in here, guys. Comment a name for our new eel. Also, comment what kind of eel it is. I'm pretty sure it's an eel. It's definitely an eel. But yeah, comment. Snake. You think it's a snake? I think it's a snake. I think it's a snake. Well, I'm gonna cut to tomorrow, where we feed all the fish, the rest of the fish that we caught. I got them in the freezer, so... We're gonna do some feedings, and yeah, we're gonna do a little update, I guess, tomorrow on our new little eel friend. We'll see you guys then. Now, it is the next day. Unfortunately, it's storming outside right now, so I will not be going outside to feed the fish, but I will give you an update on Axolotl Rose and Ely Dan. They are doing so good. They are actually like best friends right now. There's the eel right there. There's the eel, he's doing good. And there's Axolotl Rose. They were actually right next to each other. I'll throw up a video. They like really liked each other. They're like best friends, so everything's good. Check this out, you guys. I literally have the Axolotl hand trained. <laughs> Come on, oh, good boy, Axel. Good boy. Dude, I can't believe he's hand trained after like a couple days. He's so cute. Yeah, he really likes it in here. I love this thing. Come on, Axel. You want another one? Here he comes. Come on. You gotta work for it. Yes. You gotta work for it. Come on. Come on. Oh, oh, he got it. <laughs> yeah, good boy. Gosh, they are so cool. Well, I really hope you did enjoy this video. If you guys did, please go down there and leave a like. Also, comment if I should do a part two with those weird holes with all those fish in it. Subscribe if you haven't already. I think 86% of you guys are not subscribed. So if you guys are not subscribed, please go down there, hit the subscribe button, it's free. But yeah, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.